Hi everyone, Becky Thoroughgood here, and we are officially in autumn. And in Chinese medicine, that means that we're at the time of the lung and the colon. And so I'm going to show you a couple points that you can stimulate this time of year and any time of year that you need it to support your lung and your colon health and your overall health as well. All right? So first, I'm going to show you a Qigong move that has works the, um, col the lung meridian and the colon meridian. So the lung meridian starts here, and what you want to do is just start with a loose fist, kind of tap down your arm towards your thumb. So you can do that nine times. That's a big number in Chinese medicine. It's a good number for longevity. And that stimulates the lung meridian. Now, the colon meridian is the opposite side of the arm, and it begins at the beginning of the index finger and comes all the way up to here. So you can do that nine times as well. Try not to punch yourself too far, hard in the face. So to do this more efficiently first thing in the morning or whatever, you can go down the lung meridian and up the colon meridian. Down the lung meridian and up the colon meridian. And you can do that nine times. The next thing I'll show you are a couple points. And we're going to start on the lung meridian and work our way down. So lung seven, which is a point that's about two finger widths above the wrist crease on the palmar surface of the arm, is a really important point for the face and head. And it's great for migraines, it's great for nasal congestion. At the first sign of a cold or flu, we treat this point. It's good for thumb and index finger problems. I often treat this point to help that achiness that occurs at the base of the wrist, for wrist issues, and also for pent up emotions. So how you can treat these points is you can either put your finger on the point and hold it, or you can gently massage the point first in a clockwise move about nine times, and then in a counterclockwise move. So that's a way you can stimulate the point and balance its energy. The next point on the lung meridian is called Great Abyss, and this is a great point to tonify the lungs, to help move phlegm that gets stuck in the chest, also post-recovery of a respiratory illness, and to build up your immune system. And I forgot that lung seven point is called Broken Sequence. So again, you can either touch this point and hold it, or you can massage it counter, you can massage it clockwise, for about nine times, and then massage it counterclockwise nine times. The paired meridian with the lungs is the colon, and we're going to start with the colon source point. It's called joining of the valley, and uh, that's because of its anatomical location. It's right here in the web of the first finger and the thumb, and that's a great point for toothaches, headaches, uh, stomach dysfunction, um, any kind of facial swelling or tics, you can use this point. It's not for pregnant women though. Pregnant women should not stimulate this point because it can prompt labor. But everybody else, it's safe for. This is also a really good point for stress. It's one of two points that we use that are called the gates of Buddha. So. It's good for stress because it helps invoke the Buddha nature. So again, you can hold this point every day. You can massage it. It's often sore. That's pretty normal. Or you can massage it clockwise and then counterclockwise nine times. The next point on the colon meridian is called Crooked Pond, and it's here at the elbow crease on the outside edge of the elbow crease. And this point we use for all kinds of inflammation, fevers, itchy eyes from allergies, heat trapped in the body, uh, people that tend to be overly hot, 
Also, it's great for elbow and upper limb issues. It's great to uh, massage, to deal with really any kind of inflammation. So that's Crooked Pond. And then another really good point on the colon meridian is large intestine 20. And this is called Welcome Fragrance. And this point we use, as you can imagine, for stuffy nose, colds and flus, allergies, or when you're feeling like you just need clear perspective and you need, you're, you're feeling cynical and you need some fresh perspective on something. So this is large intestine 20 and that's welcome fragrance. So there you have it. You can do a quick lung colon tap to invigorate the energy and you can do that on both sides. The meridians run on both sides and then you can address each of these points for more specific help with each of the meridians. So enjoy autumn.